Hey guys, what's going on? Hammy here, and I'd like to put a little context before this video begins. Um, first of all, we filmed this on January the 3rd, and it's taken me a really long time to actually get this edited and uploaded, which I'm really sorry about. I've been super busy with um, the new year, the new semester, everything of that nature, like getting Life is Strange up and everything. And, um, well, like I said, it's just kind of swamped me, so here it is about, nah, geez, like a couple weeks later, and, um, Next, or at the end of this week, we should have our uh, regular episodes back up again. So, so just keep in mind, uh, some of the things we talk about are going to be a little bit outdated. And um, also, there's not going to be a link dump uh, to this one just because of like time crunches. I said, or rather, I had to make uh, the sacrifice. Like, am I going to get this up on time or am I going to have a link dump? So here it is, link, um, link dump list and ready to go. Thank you guys very much and I hope you enjoy the video. <laughs> Look at that! You clipped the audio. <laughs> Welcome to the third episode of the Whatever Forever Podcast, starring me, Jaden, Alex, again the hottest, Danny, the brownest. You were gonna say Danny Dixley. I'm sick. You said it for me. And Mark. <coughs> And Happy New Year's, guys! And this is our first podcast in 2016. Hopefully, there's Ooh, and our third like, gen- <laughs> and our, <laughs> our, our third to match out's January third, and not <laughs> technically. First. Well, we've been doing the podcast in two different years now. Just stop. So, so it's it our be anniversary. Like, so you know, guys, we haven't done the podcast in a whole year. Okay, podcast is over. <laughs> I'm canceling it right here, right okay, now. Okay, Danny's gonna get beat up again. So oh God, no! Okay, so I would like I'm gonna I'm gonna start this off by talking about something that happened to me um, this weekend. This weekend ish, I guess. Um, Jaden <sighs> met his uncle Tom. I'm gonna. What? Well, oh no! <laughs> Dan got it. I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and start this by saying like this caused my entire weekend to just be really interesting because as all of you guys know, I have a cousin who isn't, like, the most well-behaved or, like, nicest or smartest. human... Or the smartest human being. <laughs> that's that's going to be important here. Or in intelligent. Oh, well, yeah, never mind. Okay, <laughs> let's <laughs> stop dragging him. But anyway, um... So, I was on my computer on, like, fucking, Friday. Fucking, I, for, I forgot I the exact day of the week. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot the exact day of the week. But, um, I was sitting there. Um, I was playing uh, Hotline Miami, which, which I'll talk to you guys about in, in a second. Oh, Excellent game. Great. It's so good. But, um... And, like, I heard my, uh grandmother's phone ring and I was like oh, okay you know like, like nothing out of the usual that, that's ordinary and I heard weird hello are you okay what did you do and I was like "Ooh, this is some tea <laughs> okay so, like, I like to I like to think about how you just went and you had your fingers like, <laughs> that's as if you were no, holding no, no, a joke but but anyway people listening like, have no idea what you mean by had his fingers like yeah <laughs> oh, I'll just put like a picture in the link dump of this I'm actually gonna do that but anyway um Anyway, so, um, we have, like, a bay window that, that, like, looks out over our yard and stuff that I can the hear, lo- lo- like, what's going on at the barn and stuff, okay? Yeah. So, like, I went over there, I was sitting there, and I heard, like, and I heard, like, oh my god, are you okay? Like, is everybody okay? Did anybody get hurt? And I was like, well, this is, like, kind of serious. What's going on? Um, long story short, my cousin drove his truck into the lake. GG. How? And I... <laughs> So you know, but my reaction exactly. To him. So you know how you know how it's like, it's like a pretty common thing that rednecks do around here called mudding. Yeah. Where where they like take their trucks and get hey, he just figured the best mud would be developing <laughs> on the bottom of the lake. So so naturally, so naturally they went down like like in, into the near dried up lake bed and were like, yeah, let's go mudding. And then like one of them got stuck, and as far as I can understand it. <laughs> they um they got stuck and like and like he was trying to pull him out but the rope snapped and he rolled backwards <laughs> into the lake and like and like to put into perspective how deep it was like like the water was like above his headlights and like and, and like his backpack that was in the cab of the truck was floating and and like <laughs> he said that like he immediately put together like a response team like said Boys crack, don't worry about that. But like he called like multiple people like, like before calling my grandfather, who he lives with, <laughs> and who technically owns the truck, and was like, Hey, uh, I drove my truck into the lake. And 
and I was like, <laughs> first of all, the lake, it's not easy to get to. Like, like, I mean, with the truck, the lake is and not isn't it, easy isn't it to. illegal to be doing what they were doing? It's very illegal <laughs> to be doing. Like, like, you can get arrested for doing that. You're going to get your cousin arrested. And second of all, you... <laughs> yeah, his name is, uh... <laughs> you, you have to... His name is... I knew you were going to... I looked at him and I was like, you're going to do it? You're going to do it? Last week, um, the, 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 the sensor sound was the, uh... I, I heard it. It was like... It was the, it was the, uh, weird. doot trumpet. It was the doot doot. Yeah. <laughs> and, like... But anyway, I was, I, was very upset. I was upset that it wasn't the deer. Noise. I couldn't find the deer until like I, I put together the, the link dump later. Like I just oh couldn't God. find it for some reason. And um, anyway, long story short, um, yeah, um, it took us like like three days to to, to this car working again, which I'm surprised. Like like usually if a car goes into the water, it just doesn't work anymore. Like, like I mean, what do you <laughs> you treat like a phone? You like put it, it you put it in rice. Did you put the truck in rice? Yeah. No, oh no, did, did you get a life proof case for? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, okay, so oh my God. I'm, I did, I'm not sure if I any of you guys heard about this, case. but there's this guy. Uh, I think he works for Verizon or something. Yeah. And he was just trying to prove to these guys, like, I think it was, uh, what are they called? Like the life, they're not like life proof cases, they're like turtles. Otterbox? Like, yeah, Otterbox. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Otterbox. Have yeah. you seen this? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. No, I, I haven't seen it, but. <laughs> have you seen this? Have you heard about this? Okay, so. He's like, yeah, guys, this, this is really good. Chucks it at the wall. And then the phone shattered. <laughs> I, think I think one of my favorite things, like, related to that that I've seen is, like, is, like, there's this commercial where this dude is, like, where he's, like, clear, like, like, paper-thin, indestructible case. And he's, like, and he's, like, he's, like, <laughs> like, a bunch of people are surrounded. He's, like, I have a bowling ball. And, and, and he's, like, when I drop it, it won't do anything to the phone. And he drops it. And it goes, and it, like, it shatters. And he's, like, and he's, like. Well, and then in the video just cuts. <laughs> it's the best thing ever. And like, <laughs> there's a channel on YouTube, like dedicated entirely to like debunking, like like tech myths. Yeah, yeah, like testing how good things actually are. Did you see the one about the Nokia phones they did? Yeah, and <laughs> that's should... so beautiful. But like, he, he he did this one where he's like, where he's like, does the iPhone six plus really bend? And he just takes it and goes snapping. Like, yes. <laughs> and then the video just ends. Oh my god. I just saw a video where like, this guy, he's like, hey, I'm gonna test this phone case. They say it's bolt, but then he shoots with like a 50 caliber. <laughs> what? <laughs> I actually stopped it though, so it was pretty cool. Shh. Why would they make the phone shatter? The no, no, the phone shattered, but the bullet didn't go through it. <laughs> <laughs> it was just the impact of the bullet yeah. that. This, um, or I guess rather, these like last few weeks have been like the perfect time for like viral videos. Like, um, uh. <laughs> Oh, Immortal no. dog. Oh no. no. <laughs> Is that like a play on wisdom dog? Uh, as soon as we're done here, I'll show it to all of you guys. But um, <laughs> I'll only get two. Feet. Scissors. <laughs> only get two. Send us his paws. Scissors. <laughs> it's the best video ever. Oh my god. Your dog doesn't trust you anymore. One of my biggest like guilty pleasures is like fail compilations. And like, <laughs> like one of my break biggest com. things. Break.com is the worst. Like, they used to have a, a, week, a weekly compilation of, like, videos of bones breaking. Uh, and it's one of the things that just... Oh, how many of those things do you have? A lot. Mark is eating, like, <laughs> white chocolate peppermint Hershey's Kisses. And, like, and like I'm just looking over... You don't even like them! I'm gonna eat this just to spite you. <laughs> and, like, he just keeps pulling them, like, out of his pockets. Like, like kiss after kiss after kiss. Uh, speaking Alex of pockets, uh, Mark and Jaden are both wearing keys. <laughs> yeah, we're both wearing... I'm gonna take a picture of this to put in the link dump. But um, we are both. I hate peppermint. We're both wearing like Japanese onesies. I'm gonna take a picture of this if you guys want to vamp while we're doing this. So um, only nerds wear wear uh, uh, animal onesies, right? I thought yeah. I was gonna get beat up when I saw them. You were trying to order one. Shut up! <laughs> I want an owl. Whatever. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> I like how like, it was whapping, and then I took the picture. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. But anyway, um, and like, um, just like Alex said earlier, which you guys Animal didn't hear. Animal for nerds. Um, I've been doing Stop. nothing but playing no. video games and watching, <laughs> watching shows and stuff. Um, I don't know if any of you guys have ever heard or seen, um, Madoka Magica. Was that the anime you were crying about, like, last night? Don't, I, I want <laughs> to advise to all of you guys, do not watch Madoka Magica because it is so good, like, it'll send you spiraling into, like, a deep, dark void because of, like, this magical cat and, and like, some cute dresses. That's all it is. 
Okay, well, it messed me up so Precalculus badly. did that to me, but minus a magical cat and had a magical bald man. <laughs> oh, speaking, <laughs> speaking of Precal, speaking of Precal, I was at the mall yesterday uh, with my oh, grandparents no. and my uh, siblings. Thank goodness my parents weren't there. And um, <laughs> I saw my Precal teacher. Mr. Wet. Mr. <laughs> Mr. Wet. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> And it was so awkward because I'm like, I failed. Do you please leave, dude? You didn't fail. I failed the final bad. The, but, <laughs> but you failed the teacher. That's what you mean, right? Yeah. Okay. That's me when I go back and see um Miss Bailiff. Miss like, what? Not not Miss Bailiff necessarily, but like, let's say my like eighth grade teacher. Like um, we we. This teacher, <laughs> oh, I, I'm just gonna call him uh, Mr. D for right now. Mr. Oh. D's. And like, like I'm just gonna call him Mr. D. You, you, you both, you both oh, know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking think, about. You may not. No, but, I think um, as cool as you but guys. anyway, like, like all, all the kids loved him. They're like, hey, Mr. D. The like, one where we always hey. had to do Study Island in this class. Yeah. And oh my just, god. And he, would, and he would always be like, what are you doing on, on there? And he'd be like, oh, you know, we're, we're just, we're just doing Study Island. And he's like, yeah, don't. And he would say exactly like that. He'd be like, yeah, don't. Don't do that. And we'd all get, like, really nervous. We'd be like, okay. But, like, all the kids were like, yeah, Mr. D. And he was like, hey, yeah, all these, like, awesome kids. And he then, was the And then one day I was like, and then one day I was like, hey, Mr. D. And he said, hi. <laughs> and then and then he just walked away. And, like, from then on I was like, I have to avoid this teacher at <laughs> all costs. Like, I felt so bad. And, um, <laughs> one day I was in his class and, like, <laughs> His kids were doing, like, some kind of writing assessment. And, like, I wasn't meant to be in there. But, like, I think the rest of my class was, like, taking a test or something. And he said, well, since you're in here, you're, you're going to do it, too. And I was like, ah, I, you, you know, like, I'm not in this class. Like, I don't really know anything about the topic. I said, I'm just going to skip on it. He said, no, you're going to do it. <laughs> and he graded me on this topic that, like, they've been studying for months, but I just, I just got it. Like, I just walked into the class and he said, yeah, you're going to do it, too. It was, like, genuinely frustrating for me because I was like, why? Why are you doing this? See, I thought you were talking about Mrs. E. Oh, God, don't even get me started. Do you remember, okay, our friend Zach, the same one from the lawnmower story. The same one who got run over my window. Next week, we are having him on the podcast. So, I don't even like him. I'm going to get him on the podcast. So, he was in this class with us, and it was like Algebra 1 honors or something like that in eighth grade. And, um... We took this, like, practice end-of-course exam. Oh, boy. And Miss Edwards absolutely hated Zach. Do you want to fight with this? Oh. <laughs> yeah, like, because um, he was, like, absolutely... Like, he's a terrible student, but somehow he <laughs> absorbs knowledge like he's a sponge or something. But, um... He's really smart. He's just he, very lazy. He took this EOC... And then wasn't there the day that Miss Miss Edwards had graded them. And, like, she pulled his out of a random bunch. And she was getting so frustrated with him. Because when he finished, he started doodling pirates all <laughs> over. All over the EOC. And then really she flipped to the last page where she had the grade. And he had a 100. <laughs> <laughs> True story. Dude, I used to do that all the time to Miss Edwards when I would like write down on the paper. I would be like, I would be like, Matt, Matt is oh, pointless no. and we all have calculators <laughs> nowadays. And she would be like, is this really what you but think? No, and they would like just in grow the, um, in intensity. Absolutely. And then like, I think the last one I wrote to and, her and, like, was oh, like, you should go kill yourself. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> like, like, I, I think the last one I wrote in middle school Ms. was G? like, God. Literally nobody oh, over the age of 18 will ever she, use this in um, their life. Like just ever. <laughs> and I was like, just so she got so mad at me. <laughs> she was just so... Oh yeah, because she came up at, so she came up to you at the last like, day of school and she's like, so Jaden, is this... Happy. Like, are you oh, are God, you really God, gonna do this? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like she was like, is this really how you feel? Yeah, was, she was, she was, that, that, like, we're, we're like, looking at a pair of like uh, of like a PS4 yeah. headset right now. Excuse what is that? It's <laughs> it's basically earbuds, <laughs> except there's only one earbud. Yeah, yeah. So and they're, they're basically supposed to plug. Like you're supposed to plug into your game because like, the headphones all, don't work. Like they don't. Like you can only hear like the chat. So you plug it, put it in one ear, and you've got the mic there. It's really stupid, and they're always garbage. Mine broke within a week. Wouldn't you just like like? How do I word this? Get a good mic. Or use like the the ones that come or buy with PC like the iPhone instead. or something. Like, yeah, I was trying yeah, to find the right words. Yeah, yeah. Like I think those would work the best. Yeah. I don't really. Get, just get a PC. See. 
Nothing about yeah, them. like those. It's I mean, the same exact thing, except it's they, actual both earbuds. <laughs> they're two, and they don't last they a couple mics. Yeah. I mean, yeah, those are garbage. Good. The no, mic on this is terrible. So, terrible. now that we've switched into the topic of video games... Oh, <laughs> oh, no. No. Don't talk about Dragon's Dog. <laughs> I totally beat Dragon's Dog I, like five more times. I have been drowning in video games for like the past two weeks of my life. I'm so I only played Fallout happy. 4 and Bloodborne. I played <laughs> this guy, go. he came over to my... Dan, he came over to my house, and I had just bought Watch Dogs and Dragon's Dogma Dark Arisen, which is an expansion... <laughs> Which involves less walking and more dying a lot. <laughs> so more like, like Dark Souls. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. And what did like, you talk about um, your issue with uh, Dragon Age? Oh my god. Okay, <laughs> so I went over to my dad's, and he was just like, "Hey, you might not get to see me uh, more than what you're doing right now. So here's two twenty-five dollar Walmart cards." And I'm just like, "Well, that's really nice. cool." That's really awesome, so dude. I went to Walmart, and I'm just like, "What should I get?" Well, probably just something I can throw more of my life away on. So I got a new controller <laughs> and Dragon Age Inquisition, because I heard it's really good. And I've beaten it six times. <laughs> so and it's really bad, actually. So. I got home. I actually don't like it very much. And I tried, I tried to install it, and it's just like, hey, you need an Xbox hard drive. And I'm just like, excuse me? If I can download the entirety of the GTA game onto my little that's micro what did, USB. That's what didn't make any sense to me. Wait, what? Yeah, yeah, it like, said, I can't play it without a hard drive. See, what's what's really getting me about this is, like, I'm a very tech-savvy person. Oh, is that why you wanted the external hard drive? Mm -hmm. And, like, w and like the first thing is, uh, the Xbox uh, 360, uh, USB-wise, is limited to a 64 gig um, capacity. And, uh, like, in order to have an Xbox hard drive, you have to install it internally on the Xbox, which is super hard to do. And... Which, which first things first, why wouldn't it say that like somewhere on the box, like, like, like you need oh. this much storage to, to play this game? Like, because, um, the... well, no, what really gets me is the installation is only like 7.5 gigs. What, yeah. And, and I think GTA five is like 50 gigs. No, no. Well, on the Xbox, it was like eight. On, on the really? computer, it's a Because on the more. PC, it takes up 65 gigs yeah, yeah, on my it, hard drive. Oh yeah, my God. Yeah. On PC. It took me, it took me like a day and a half to download and I mean, like, I mean, of course, I was way too excited. Like, I just started downloading it instantly. I, I, I think I've sunk like two hundred hours into the game at this point. I love GTA Five so much. It's such a good game. I loved GTA Five but, um, too. <laughs> I would have loved to play GTA Five too, Mark. But you know, but, and we'll Dragon's right. Dogma. We'll tell that story <laughs> later. But anyway, like that just makes no sense to me. Like, like because EA, especially in the past just doesn't give a crap about their customers mm -hmm. in general. Mm -hmm. Like, because I, I bought um, Mass Effect 3. It's all about the money! <laughs> I bought Mass Effect 3, <clears throat> and they were like, and they were like, well, you know, you, you could get the regular version, or you could get the, 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 the like, special edition, or you could get the digital deluxe version. Yeah. And digital, I was like... Digital deluxe is like, hey, you get two skins, but it's $80 more. That was exactly what it was! Like, I, um, I, I think I'm going to buy uh, Dragon Age, right, B very soon. I'll, okay. I'll kill it has, okay. I will I'm kill gonna, you okay. if you get to play it before okay. dude, I do. Dude, 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 I'm going to let you just know one thing right now. I've romanced, like, everyone in the entire game. This scene! <laughs> um, Dorian is the best. Dorian is fucking amazing. Are we talking like about Dragon, Dragon Age? Or? Yeah, yeah, Dragon Age. Dorian is fucking hard. That's me in, um... I'll keep that in mind. <laughs> Mass Effect right now. Yeah. It's because, like, this morning I woke up and, like, I immediately jumped into Mass Effect 3. It's such a good game. Oh, my God. But I'll talk more about that soon. Um, but anyway, like, I went on the website, and they were like, yeah, here's the standard version. It's, like, 10 bucks, and I was like, awesome. And they were like, but here's the special edition. 30 bucks. That's I'm mom's calling. Burp. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> we're just going to keep going. Look at this little shit. Yeah, I, I, I'm probably going to cut this part out. So now that we're... Uh. At <laughs> God damn it, Mark. So now that we're actually back after Mark called his mom... <laughs> This episode, we, this episode is going to be called God Damn It, Mark. It absolutely is. We, we, we watched um, Immortal Dog. And anyway, as I was saying, I need to do that too. It's getting really yeah. hot there. I think this can't go on. Well, I've got this in a black shirt. <laughs> fucking Jesus. Take my second we, um, skin off. Um, it's like every now and again, you just see a video like that. That, that just captures it's your heart and soul. Tummy. It it absolutely does, and like I don't know if you guys, I don't know if you guys have seen the video of the um lady. Is that left shark? Like the sh no, it's just sharks. Okay. okay. The the um the uh lady 
who's like re- really excited about these sponges. Have you ever seen that video? I can't say I have. I need to link it. It's this lady who's just like, well, you guys wanted another video, so here's the the painting sponges. And, she, and she's like painting the sponges, and she like goes, oh, oh, that's so, oh my god, that's beautiful. And she's like getting so excited about these paintings that she's making with sponges. It's like one day, like, I hope to be like so blissfully unaware that like my life revolves around like how i paint with sponges and she's like wait a second if we if we turn it this way oh my god oh there it is there it is honestly honestly i'm the same way when it comes to art if you play goofy evanescence again i swear mark you also listen to uh goofy evanescence that's an example of a video that like you hear it and it kind of changes your life a little bit He's watching the video! I was like, wait a second, he's watching the video! (laughs) Oh my god, no. It's one of the best videos I've ever seen in my entire life. And like, that's no exaggeration. She's like, and then, oh! Oh, look at that, there it is. Look at all those wiggles. It's the best thing ever. Oh my god. Oh my god. But anyway, like like, as I was saying, um, like, videos like those are like what immortalize the fact that like the internet can be such a wonderful place. Like, well, well, all at the same time, be, like, being just one of the worst places ever. Like... Yeah, like, Jane's Block, for example, is one of the worst places ever. Oh, it ever. absolutely is. It yeah, absolutely it, is. It, it gave me cancer. I've just been shitposting about <laughs> anime as of late. I know. Oh, I my God. you. <laughs> God. You're talking about, like, a Tumblr I'm blog? glad I don't yeah. have yeah. Tumblr on my phone. <laughs> the, the Love Live anime movie is so good it's why don't you so why don't you just say your say your blog name real genuinely quick. good uh it's, 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 it's already in your channel it's linked you could find it in my channel F- follow me for more dank memes <laughs> they're bad anime memes I don't can't, follow him i can't believe the last meme of 2015 was the uh pants meme i don't know if you saw it you might have seen it so i saw but, something it was like does a dog wear pants like this? And or, or and then it's just like the girl from like um uh Full Metal Alchemist. No! <laughs> oh, no! 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 Oh no, my no. god! No! Why? <laughs> oh, that's fantastic! Jesus! The uh oh the, the 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 little girl who was turned into like yeah, half yeah, a dog yeah. a homunculi. I don't know. Oh my god! I never watched Full Metal Alchemist. Anyway, anyway, I don't. <laughs> I'm gonna link the meme. But like, it was just like if a dog wore pants, would would wear it like this or like this? And it made me so angry because it was just like, why is this what we're focusing on right now? Like, why is this the last meme of 2015? Like, like why could we have like a nice wholesome meme? Like, emo Kylo Ren. Just, just e- throwing exactly. this out. Throwing this out. My stepdad calls memes memes because he doesn't memes. know how to say them. <laughs> memes. Whenever I was, whenever I was like first getting into, like whenever I was just, like coming onto the internet, I called them memes, completely unironically, like because I was like, well, you know, like, watch like, me like, wit. And watch me may may. <laughs> God. So, um, how long until we uh, officially cancel the podcast? Uh, like how long, right now. How long until Yesterday. It's done? <laughs> no. Last Friday. I think, I think whenever Mark stepped on the cord and, and unplugged the microphone. That's why you shouldn't have told me player. to sit up. <laughs> I was like, hey, we should, like, you know, Mark says some things. We should have him, should have him, like, be able to be heard instead of, like... Sounding like this, that the entire actually thing. he'd still be able to be. Yeah, right. I was uh, I was <laughs> actually closer where closer where closer than where Dan was. His so. head was on my huge dong. <laughs> come, here. come here, Danny Dixley. Here, I'm coming. Jesus, <laughs> oh my God. Came but um, there. anyway, <laughs> as I think I mentioned earlier, um, I, I beat uh, Hotline Miami. That is one of the. Uh, <laughs> Please, please send me that. Please send me a link to that. I, I, I should, I should Jaden a picture. Uh, oh. it, it, it's it's uh, emo Kylo Ren like the Twitter page. Yeah. It says spends a whole afternoon unsuccessfully struggling to open a clean wrapped My Chemical Romance CD. Have you seen Star Wars yet? No. Have you seen Star Wars yet? No. Oh come on, God. guys. I did see uh, Hunger Games: so Mocking Jay Part Two because so my oh, brother and sister wanted to. It, it was actually. I thought it was really good. I I, I personally didn't. really like the Hunger Games. <laughs> Don't lean that, don't like, that close. Imagine, I didn't I didn't see the first Mocking Jay part, but dealing with morning sickness. I kind of got the gist of it because. <laughs> What's up? Well, sorry, but <laughs> someone else on the podcast was so rudely talking over you. I just came for the breadsticks. <laughs> <laughs> Sadly, uh, we're out of breadsticks. I know. I'm, I'm, I was I'm kidding. going. Bye. <laughs> anyway, what were but you like, saying? <clears throat> the thing is, like. Now there's a whole bunch of those you know, dystopian movies like Divergent yeah. and 
But see, see just the kinda... thing about it is that like I yeah. haven't seen like one of them that's bad. Like I think they're all really good. Like, like it's not that I'm, not, I'm sorry to interrupt no, you. No, you're good. Like, Go ahead. It's not that they're bad per se, but it's just like they kind of all do the same thing over <laughs> yeah. time. Yeah. But it's like down now, now there's rebels fighting, and then di- diversion. I saw the um, next one's previews in the theater, and then that one's also like so now the world isn't real, and there's rebels fighting. Yeah, yeah. It, it's always like that. Like even with the Maze Runner movies, it turned into that in the second one. Um, th- that was the whole thing that, that, like, I guess I noticed while I was reading, um, this book series called, uh, The Gone Series. It's, uh, um, you might have read them. <sighs> Jesus. Isn't it, isn't that when, like, it all of a sudden just the parents aren't there? All the parents disappear. <gasps> oh and my god, those books are so good. They're really good, but the second one, have you read all of them? I think I've, re- there are like four, right? Yeah. I've read the th- three. Okay. This is just me. Put your phone... He's showing me memes! Alex is showing me memes! No, put it away! But, like, like the first one was really good, and then, and then I went back and I read the second one. The second one's not really good. Like, like I just didn't really think it was very good, personally. Like, like, I mean, like, the first one, I couldn't put down. Like, it was so good. And the second one came along, and it was like, yeah, well, now we have, like, worms that are just kind of doing a lot of stuff. And I was like, okay. They're well, doing worm I mean, things. Well, well, I'm like, the first book was like, there's magic and there's radiation. The parents are gone and running out of food. And like, everybody loves each other. And like, we're trying to survive. Like, there's teenagers. We're learning like amazing adults. And then the next one was like, worms. So we got. You heard about worms? Okay. And, and then got some like, worms. How do you like, fried worms? Well, no, because like, I like that because you kind of saw the slow decay yeah. in the, their the society. society. Yeah, society. and I mean, I, I can entirely understand that, but, like, I started reading it and I just said, this doesn't feel like a Gone book to me. Like, it just doesn't really feel like that kind of book. You read one. <laughs> well, yeah, but, but, I mean, but like, I mean, like, I came so attached se- to all the characters. Question, did you read it sequel. in Miss H's room? Like, Yes, the, I, I got, absolutely did. <laughs> I got three books and gave them to... Mm-hmm, I absolutely did. She, she has so many amazing books in her room, absolutely. I know. Oh now my god. Is it recording in both layers now? No, um, <laughs> what I had to do, what, um, was I had to split it into different layers so that way it would, it would oh, go over god it properly. Me. So, um, yeah, so we just kind of <laughs> ruined the illusion that Mark totally didn't step on the mic cord and completely <laughs> unplug the mic and stop the recording, like, halfway through. Thanks, Mark. We love you. Oh my god. Yeah. But anyway, um... Another thing, like I said, I, I picked up um, uh, Mass Effect 3, and I started playing it this morning. God, that game is so... You said you were going to play Dark Souls. Fucking Oh, well, yeah, I played Dark Souls 2. I, Don't like it. I'm wow. <laughs> it, it, it's nothing like Dark Souls 1. Uh, Bloodborne is more like Dark see, Souls 1. The that, only thing that's the same well, is like the um, fighting, a, different, different people. Different people made it. Yeah, I don't I don't like Dark Souls 2. I'm just because, gonna like, I think what happened was the person who made Dark Souls 1, um, he stopped... And they tried to keep it going, and then he yeah. moved on to do Bloodborne yeah, or something yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. The, like the like the leading director or something. Like yeah, that? yeah. yeah, yeah. That, that's I why like Bloodborne has like such a close yeah. feeling to Dark Souls. Yeah, which is, I, I I love Bloodborne and Dark Souls one, but I do not like Dark Souls two. I'm gonna be real. I liked it. How far into uh, Bloodborne are you at right now? Um, I just beat the. Okay, so I, I'm sure you watched the game. Is there okay? Oh, so I, I'm playing it for. Okay, I've been playing it for a week and. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm, yeah. Oh, I'm trying terrible. to fight him, and he's horrible. Yeah, oh, absolutely. I killed, the, I, I killed the hunter that's down there. Jesus. Okay, it took me three days to beat the cleric beast. <laughs> oh my god. Fa- Father Gascoigne, no. right, or ha- whatever you say his name, beat him on my third try. <laughs> Jeez. Like, he wasn't that hard. Yeah, but look, like he, he he's still just terrible. Yeah, it, like plus, um, plus I got the music box. So. Um, I've been watching the uh, Grumps play it while I've been playing uh, Starbound. I don't, know if, I don't know, you might have played Starbound. Have you played Starbound? I Is it the thought, close to Terraria like game? Very it's close. Thought, okay, then okay. good. It's so, 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 thought, so good. Oh my god. I thought that I'd played it, but I'd actually played Edge of Space. <laughs> so sorry. Um, I actually, uh, how do I word this? Speaking of games that have like the esque of Minecraft, um, I'm thinking of starting like a five person Minecraft server, like just just for us. I don't have internet. Well, never mind. <laughs> I would completely <laughs> join you, except... By the way, there are only four people here, not five. I well, yeah, you, but, okay, I was about to say, I don't think you can yeah, just no. make them... Well, like, you can make them four, but, like... Yeah, um... Then you got a weird number. There's a service called, like, Minecraft Homachi? Air Hosting. No, 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 no. <laughs> like, 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 dedicated, um... I think it's, like, MC Pro Host or something. And, mm. like, you can get a five-person server 
with like full support for like two dollars a month, and I was like, no brainer. So yeah. um, I th- I think we all paid. I think that's what I'm gonna do. We so, all pay fifty cents to keep it up. Yeah, well, like here's here's our two uh, quarters. I don't know if I can do that <laughs> now. <laughs> it's a bit steep, yo. But like anyway, after playing uh Starbound for like two nights in a row, I want to start like a dedicated dedicated. That I created, desecrated. <laughs> I, I haven't spoken <laughs> to like uh, another human being oh. in months. I, like, for a minute, I months. thought he was just like I thought he said I've been smoking. <laughs> oh God, like... no! Hey guys, I've been smoking to another person since last year. <laughs> Eh, eh, not spoken to the person since. Oh, okay, I guess oh. we're now we're gonna beat up Jason. Oh god! Episode. Oh jeez! No. <laughs> um, but yeah, no. <laughs> l- l- like the more and more I play it, the more I'm like, I want like, I want a lot of people to play this with me. It's so much fun. Like because I, I was playing um uh, Terraria and I was like, this just lacks something, and Starbound is that something. Like it's so good. <laughs> Dan and I are offended. Uh, no, I, I'm not saying. Uh, nope, you are. I'm not saying. I agree with you. I don't agree with you. Terraria is kind of lame. It. Oh. Yeah, can uh, when do you guys give me a uh, torrented copy of that so I, I can just play that? I think they're all good. I, I was messaging Alex last night about like. <laughs> Anime is that you're crying over? No, no, not only that. I was like, hey, um, is the pirate base safe? And I was like, and, like, like because <laughs> whenever it finally came back. Like, like I, I'd been reading some things, and it was like, and it was like, yeah, the pirate, the pirate bay is now like a honeypot, and like, people who use it are being logged, like, l- l- like that their IPs are being logged, and and I was like, well, I mean, like I I actually ended up not using it, but I was like, well, I mean, it's sketchy, yeah. yeah. I was like, well, I mean, but mm, my grandparents like torrent movies every night, so I was like, what, like you know. If I get arrested, we're all going to get arrested. <laughs> if my IP's already in there, then you know. <laughs> and I was like, if I get arrested, then Alex is going to get arrested, and that means Danny and Mark are going to get arrested, too. Not really. So no. we, we can all do the podcast from jail, all right? <laughs> I just and, got the, the like, the flashback to the SpongeBob episode where Mrs. Puff has to teach <laughs> SpongeBob. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, no. Oh, my this God. This is a no SpongeBob Um. Play? When I was watching um, Madoka Magica, um, mm, no. I was like, I was like, oh, absolutely! But I was like, I wonder what SpongeBob would look like if he was a cat, as an anime, as a magical girl. And, and uh, I, I just looked up SpongeBob Magical Girl. Oh no! Oh no! I'll put this in the link dump. It's one of the best pictures I've ever seen in my entire life. It's so well drawn. <laughs> and then um, you know, Danny at like. Like as soon as I'd woken up, he, he seemed like a picture that was like that was like sank, <laughs> sank the hedge, and I was like, oh god. I think I, I, I think the fast. best I, I think the best picture uh, like, like that, that I've ever seen was one that that says snart the hard fog. <laughs> snart the hard fog. Snart the hard fog. Are, are you looking up? I'm looking up the SpongeBob. Yeah, just look up SpongeBob Magical Girl. I, I, I oh put my SpongeBob god. Yeah, but like Magical Girl. I was talking to Amanda. And we were talking about how we have to do our AP US history homework, and we're like, we have to get it done you fast. You really still haven't done that? <laughs> shut, shut up. Shut up. <laughs> and we're like, we have to get this done really fast. And I'm like, I have a picture on my phone, and it's a picture of a whole bunch of different, God, like, is it that? Sonic memes. Please. And there's a ca- the caption in the picture, it says, go so fast that the thrill of speed evades the fe- makes you evade this fear of death or something. Yeah, and I was like, Mark. What? There it is, the SpongeBob magical girl. Oh no! It's the best thing ever. It looks like my but, character on Dragon's Dogma. But no, That's first me. of all, the one that fucks the blacksmith. Watch. Actually, I, I'm sorry to interrupt no, you. No, you're good. Go ahead. I played through it about three more times, and like, apparently, your How affinity. How is that game? It, well, if you do side quests, it lasts forever. But if you just go through the story and Mass like, effect. oh my god, I do every single side quest. Uh, eventually, Mass like, um. There's these things called port crystals that let you teleport to them, so it takes the whole walking the thing away crystals. from the game. Yeah. So when you put them down, they stay there forever. Like even when you go to the next game, yeah, yeah, they, I they're there. That. Yeah. So like I can like just fast traveling. Yeah. yeah. So I I've put it everywhere the main story goes. So oh. when I'm doing the main story, I'm just like. <laughs> I I think. It's like. <laughs> but like, apparently the affinity for the character stays the same throughout the game, oh. like throughout the playthroughs. So like. I got stuck with Caxton another three times <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> before before oh I'm just like, you know what? And then I hit him with a long sword, and, and it's gone. It's done. Dude, it's... that <laughs> Mass Effect Caxton. Mass Effect does the uh, the the exact same thing. Like I've noticed while playing Mass Effect Three, where, where it's like Mass Effect Two. Like I could have said like one wrong thing on accident to like an NPC, and like you see them in 
the Citadel in the next game, and they're like, you, it was you, and they, like, try to hit you, and you're like, and I'm like, this happened, like, a month ago, and, like, four years ago in game time. Oh, well, like, I, I think the coolest thing uh, uh, about Mass Effect 3 is that, like, you, you can import your, like I said, you can import yeah, your, yeah. your Mass, Mass Effect, Effect 2 save. save. Yeah, yeah, you can do Dragon Age 2. It's, it's, Mass Effect is quickly becoming, like, my most favorite game ever. Like, it's just so wonderfully made. Like, it looks beautiful. Like, seriously, Mass Effect just looks... My hair keeps getting stuck behind my glasses. <laughs> like, it just genuinely... Oh my God, it just Mark. genuinely looks... I'll hit you. <laughs> it just genuinely Started looks it. so good. I, I I feel like a dad on this podcast. Like, no, <laughs> behave, behave, all of you. I'm not doing anything wrong. We'll put you in a solitary good box. Good child. I was actually thinking, You're the good child. I was actually thinking about that. Like this podcast is literally just you babysitting me. And Mark. <laughs> really, it absolutely is. I'm like, sit up, Mark. Lean close to the microphone, Mark. Don't eat your don't vegetables. <laughs> you can't have dessert yet. How can you have any pudding? Speaking you of dessert, your meat. Okay, like it wasn't uh, as much of a Christmas present, but like I've always wanted these, <laughs> and this is gonna seem kind of childish, but it's like. The, the popsicle things where you can just pour any drink. Dude! I got some! Don't I even, got okay. some. Okay, we used to have some of those. I wish I knew where they went because I would make anything into a popsicle. Mountain Dew and grape soda popsicle. Oh, no. Dude, dude, dude. Take take Sprite mm-hmm. and put gummy bears in it. Uh-huh. And make it in, into a popsicle, okay? Yeah. It's the best thing mm-hmm. ever. Like, I, I was like, oh, what can I make out of a popsicle today? I I swear. Like, I, I think I made, like, um I, I made a uh, creamsicle. In that. Yeah, I got this. I got the slightest idea of like pouring Activia and a little bit of ice cream in it. <laughs> hey, pour some vodka in it. <laughs> Mix a martini popsicle. I would die. Okay, if I can talk about. Yeah, uh, yeah, you uh, would die. Uh, uh, yeah. If I can talk about uh, Activia for a second. I love Activia. Some of the lifesaver, dude. Activia. Like because n- not to make like a um, I uh, uh, real talk. I really want to get to, to like the point um, on the podcast where like we can have sponsors. For this the is podcast. episode three. This is only episode three. We have not sold out yet. But it's it's <laughs> yeah. it's really hard to um, or how to word this? But like have a podcast on iTunes, like like not because it has to get approved or anything. You have you have to host it on your own server, like like which is really really weird to me, and I'm not entirely sure how to do it, like. If if anybody out there at all knows like, like how to do this, because like I was looking at it and it was like it's like you have to have like all this, and I was like I have all this, and like you have to have this thing called a- an XML RSS feed attached to it that you have to host on your own private server, which I have genuinely no idea how to do, and it's one of the worst platforms like like of getting your your podcast out there like because like a lot of people notice it if it's on iTunes and stuff right like right now I only have like. Like, you know, YouTube and SoundCloud to do it to, which even SoundCloud I can't do because, um... There's a good, like, 40 people who normally stay mm-hmm. tuned, though. Um, there's a good 40 people that stay tuned on SoundCloud? <laughs> no, a, a, uh, free account on SoundCloud is up to, like, 230 minutes, and a pro account has, like, unlimited, of course, but, like, a pro account's kind of expensive, and, um... Like, I'm, I'm just not sure, but, like, right now, YouTube is the best way to, like, distribute this podcast, but iTunes, like I said, is free, and um, I just don't know how to set up like like an RSS feed. It's it's it makes like it's neat, really needlessly sorry I can't speak needlessly mm. difficult. So like like you know maybe maybe we'll have a sponsor soon if I can get that out there on iTunes. I we should find a way to like yeah, just can, one time just live podcast because you know all these mess ups that, that have happened. Dude, I can do that right here. Like oh. really any time that that we want to. Absolutely, yeah, yeah. we can just do a live. Yeah, stream. yeah um, like, because um. I, I have, like, using OBS down to a science at this point. Like, it's really not hard at all to do. Um, Dude, like, next Friday or, like, next yeah. Saturday or something? We I'll, can do, I'll, like, I'll a live stream. I'll have to see, like, because if I did stream, I, I'd want to stream to YouTube, which, which yeah. I haven't tried yet. Like, I, I usually do just stream to, to Twitch. That reminds me. Stream. Oh, no. I want to talk about Bioshock. Yeah. Oh, um, no. um, oh God. I... I I, I stream a lot, like, like just for my followers in Tumblr, really. Oh, I realized yeah. you streamed. Yeah, yeah. Um, I beat Bioshock 1. And um, after I beat Mass Effect 3, I think I'm going to get uh, onto Bioshock Infinite. Because uh, apparently, like, everyone's saying just skip Bioshock 2. Like, because it, it's... it's Don't you play like, as a Big Daddy or something like it, that? You, you play as a Big Daddy Mass Okay. Spoilers. Uh, like, like, I'm just going to go ahead and talk about the game. Are, are you cool with that? Yeah. Are, are you I'm cool with that? Play it. Okay. Yeah, I know you've beaten it, so... Yeah, um... You... Uh, like, like, the final mission is, like... Or, like, leading up to the final mission, you play as a Big Daddy. Wh- which, I mean, like, just felt to me... Like, they were like, it's okay, we don't really, 
whatever. And then they're like, you're in a big daddy. Like, like that's how that felt uh, to me. But don't, don't be fooled. That game was so good. Oh, my God. Like, like, like that, oh, my God. The ending was perfect to me. I know Danny didn't really like the ending. What ending like, did you get, though? I got the ending where, where like, you, you went to the surface with all of the uh, little sisters. And they're like, you gave them hope. You gave them a family. And they made me like, so genuinely happy, like, 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 because toward the end of the game, like, like, Atlas realized I'm not, like, a real human being. Like, I was made here in Rapture. Like, like I was manufactured by Fontaine. And, and, and he was like, what, what do I do now? And they killed Fontaine. And, like, all the little sisters trusted him now. Like, it, it made me really happy, like, because he, you know, he managed to evolve, but, like, that much as a character. And Fontaine... And a Pokemon. Fontaine, in, in, in the last, um, uh, boss battle... He was buff, like, but like the first time you saw him, he was like, yeah, you know, big buff wolf man. He was like, he was like, oh, I'm gonna kill you, and, and then like, I think you could like, like he was like slow to send into madness, like over the radio. He was like, whoa, these plasmids are, and he it was really good, really whoa, and then like, and like when you faced him, he was like, I got all the plasmids in rapture, and he was like twice as tall and like like muscles this big. It was insane. But yeah. like, I personally thought the game was absolutely amazing. Tim, I benched three fifty. <laughs> Of, of plaid like, <laughs> yeah, it was like all <laughs> happy and cat. stuff, but it just it, didn't do a total fun it felt like that yet. was more of a face than actual fulfillment of like emotion or anything. Yeah, I mean, it, and I could entirely understand that, like because it, because it didn't really explain like, like Rapture very well and stuff. Like it didn't really explain like, like why you came to Rapture and stuff. I think it's based on a book actually. Like I, I've heard that the Bioshock series is based on a book. Which I like, you know, if if you're listening, you could confirm or sorry, I'm like having the hiccups right now. You could like confirm or deny that, but like if if, if so, like they did really good for for a game that's based on a book, because well, like like apparently the author who wrote the books um like isn't gonna continue writing them, but they're still gonna keep making Bioshocks, which I'm really worried about because EA just. God, man. They slowly ruin everything that's ever been available ever. <laughs> why? Why is every single one of their games like you, you get the game and then you get like the deluxe edition? edition. Like, I, we're gonna talk about this, but it still like genuinely upsets me. Like I just don't understand that. All right, so can I talk about Dragon Age for a second? Yeah, go ahead. Oh, so Dragon Age Two, we all know is mm-hmm. complete shit. Yeah. I did, horrible. I didn't know no, that. No, I, no, I, yeah. I, I okay. Actually, yeah, I played it and um, I'm just like, this feels kind of more like uh, if they were to take World of Warcraft and just like make yeah. it single player. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and like you can't change any of your companions' armor or weapon armors or weapons. So it's like, why would they? The point? I like that's what I like about Dragon's why would Dogma. They take that, like you why would have they take that out of the game. Dan Dan watched so me. Dan watched me get that DLC and sit there for literally like a day. <laughs> just he said like, like, okay, total. Two days, I'm going to say, like, uh, somewhere hours. around 8 to, like, 12 hours <laughs> playing this DLC combined. Nice. I sat there watching him the entire time, and I'm just like, yeah, that's pretty cool. I won't down to play Dragon's Dogma because, you know, he had the Dark Arisen disc, so he's like, yo, you can have the original Dragon's Dogma so you can play it on your Xbox. <laughs> well, you know, go to load it up. <laughs> the Xbox doesn't read the disc. Oh. Same thing happened when he gave me a GTA yeah, 5. Yeah, like, something, I, either Maybe something's up with his Xbox. Xbox. Yeah, I was about to say. No, because I played GTA 4, and it read that just fine, and I played a few other games. It's, Maybe... I think it's just... Do you have, like, one of the... Like, I think the CM Xboxes? Games might have just gypped me, though. But, I mean, like, if it works on your Xbox, then why, why wouldn't it work well, on Well, GTA 5 GTA was 5. kind of stopping to work on my Xbox, mm-hmm. but Dragon's Dogma was doing fine. I'm not a huge fan of, of CM Games, like, like for that thing exactly... But, sorry. I mean, phrase that like for that reason exactly is because they can just be like kind of sleazy with their stuff uh, like like because um like like before, before my uh 3ds w- w- was all scratched like I, I walked into I, I walked into there and I was like um I was like hey you know, like you know just curious how much do you think I, I, I could get for this and they're like okay well for two dollars we're gonna check it out and they were like yeah it's too badly damaged so we can't buy it and I said dude I got it a week ago Brand new, what were like you talking about? Like, relatively a week ago. And I was like, and, uh, like, and it just felt like really just, like, kind of weird to me. Like, I, 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 like, just something about CM Games just kind of makes me feel iffy. Yeah, I don't know. They're sketchy. It, it might just be because um, I, I have all these, like, bad memories of uh, being drugged to Friday Night Magic. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. no. I thought you were but, saying um, bad memories of being drugged, and I was yeah, like, no, what? <laughs> but, um, let's not mention Daniel, because it, this will turn to shit talking. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, let's just not do that. Yeah, good. But, um, 
I wanted to get, um, like, ever since I read, um, like, ever since I started reading, I still haven't finished it, ever since I started reading, um, the Pokemon manga, I was like, I kind of want to get, I kind of want to get in, in, into, like, comics and manga and stuff, right? Like, there's this really awesome comic called the, uh, Lumberjanes that I saw there that I really want to... you watching Jane from Homestuck being a lumberjack. Jesus. That I really want to, like, get into, but... One thing I realize is that books are expensive. Like books are so genuinely expensive. Like like um uh, the first um the, like the first book in the uh, Lumberjanes was like forty dollars. Trees are expensive. And, and um, <laughs> <laughs> you were like you were like yeah we lose oxygen and whatever. That was like really passive aggressive. You're like I mean you don't like to breathe or whatever whatever. But um. <laughs> But um, I, was gonna say, I said three you, words, and you you just like you took it and turned it completely against me. But um, I was gonna say, but like a a, a black and white like manga, because I was like I might as well get into manga and stuff too. It's like fifteen dollars, like it's just so genuinely expensive. Oh no. And um, like like of course I would go to like um, McKay's or something, but they're that's Knoxville, and they're like equally as expensive. Like it's just it's just insane. Sorry, you remember the video about the punk sponges? Online. Yeah, but I mean, like, like you know, just feeling. Wait, hold on a second. Like, like you know, just feeling a book though is like the best thing ever. Hey, well, like, what, what's up? Remember the video about the the sponges? It's called "I'm Terrified of Getting Old." Wait, what? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what? Same. What? I think it's a hidden message. It's just straight up call. I'm terrified of getting old. Oh my god! I was like, no, no. What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> I just saw like a, a really weird image of SpongeBob just like air humping a wall. <laughs> Jesus, do you want a no, sponge? Don't don't do that. Oh my god. What else have I been playing? Um mm. Let me say Fallout 4 is really good. Mm, I need I need to get Fallout 4. I Dude, need I will, to get Fallout I need to get 4. A new it's, really good. it's it's actually <laughs> I, I don't like Fallout. I don't like Fallout, but I it's love so Fallout 4. Yeah. Um, that, if, that, if that doesn't explain how good it is, nothing will. Like, I can't oh, stand it. To <laughs> um, that was like. Sit up, you guys are gonna be grounded. <laughs> that was like. <laughs> okay, Daddy J. Alright, Danny's gr- Don't Don't call me Daddy. <laughs> <laughs> call me Daddy. <laughs> no! <laughs> um. The, uh, the, that held the same thing with, like, uh. Just for example, like like Star Wars. Like if there was a whole generation of people who had never heard of Star Wars and the new one came out. And now there's an emo kid in it. And and, <laughs> and like everybody loves Star Wars, which I'm so happy about. Like, like because like like, like so I, no, it makes me so happy that everyone is like getting involved in Star Wars and stuff. Like I just ah, it makes me so happy. Like because I grew up like watching Star Wars and I'm like yes, please like, 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 just realize how amazing this is. Like you know, it makes me really happy. And uh, another thing that really bothers me is like. Whenever, whenever older like, like fans of the show like like like, like gatekeep it from new fans. <laughs> you're a fan now. Well, I mean, you weren't a fan thirty years ago before you were born, so you're not a fan. Yeah, no. Look, <laughs> it's like Alex. It, it, it's like yeah, I've been around since the original series, and it's like I wasn't alive. Like, what are you talking about? Like, I just I don't understand. Everyone knows you're really only a real fan if you have blades and you're plugging to a wall. If you have what? <sighs> Wait, what? Gene heard me. <laughs> I didn't hear if you. You have what that can plug into the wall? I said you have blades and you're plugged into the wall. <laughs> oh my god. Podcast is over. Well, guys, we made it three episodes. Um, it was a good run. Fun. I fun times. Hour into this recording. We're, we're like 15 minutes. We can keep going. Okay, cool. We're like um, 15. Did you say 15 or 50? No, 50. So okay. like 15, 15 more minutes, something like that. Um, I also... Uh, uh, was watching like before you guys came here. I started watching um this anime called um Mister. What was it called? I'm not sure how to pronounce this. Like Punch Man. Man. Not yet. That's my next oh, one. No. Um, I, I might actually watch it. Mister. Osomatsu, I guess is how you pronounce it. Um, it's about like like Mr. Oats. It's about like how do I word this? Like it's so hard to explain. Like because this this anime is just all over the place, like all the time. Um, like it starts out. In black and white, all these, all these like kids are sitting around, and they're like, "Well, you know, um, '80s anime is just over. Like nobody watches it much anymore." And they're like, "I have an idea. Why don't we try and fit in in like modern 2000s anime?" And they and they try to, and it's one of the most insane things ever. Like it, it has references to like every modern anime ever. Like it, it had a um, 
Love Live reference and I screamed and he was so happy. But um, it had like it had like a um a uh, like you it, it it had a free reference. It had a um uh, uh, Attack on Titan reference. How was he? It free was just and off mixed up. Yeah. I, <laughs> what off is in the off is in the game? Yeah, yeah, or? the game. I was getting mixed up. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> They're completely different, but I was getting mixed Jesus. up. Jesus. Like, like, oh, my God. Like, like uh, one time Tate was like, oh, yeah, yeah, uh, this is from that one anime free. And I was like, oh, that's the guy, this thing with the batter, right? <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. No, 100%, dude. I'm sorry. But, oh, my God. I, I just, um, up. I just, um, like, it's just, it's just genuinely, don't dress that way. <laughs> like, it's just genuinely interesting. Like, I don't know. If you guys want to, you can go watch it. It's, it's just really hard to explain. I don't have internet. <laughs> I, I was just gonna say. I just feel like I really need to harp that. Cause like, <laughs> yeah, uh, Mark is acting a lot like Kylo Ren right now. Is it? <laughs> it's like you guys really can't appreciate uh, the uh, <laughs> not having internet. <laughs> you guys can't appreciate Darth Vader's march until you hear it on vinyl. It's <laughs> okay, dude. Dude, I actually saw something. Just like. I bet Kylo Ren probably tried to make a make his uh, lightsaber black at first, but then he was really upset when it didn't work. And someone else oh was like, God. someone was like, no, it probably worked, but it was like, a, but it was like a black light, so he didn't come all over his Darth Vader pose. No! <laughs> no! 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 Oh no! Why you gotta? Why you gotta do that? I mean, come I gotta on. drag Kylo Ren. Yeah, oh God, seriously. Go see the go see the new Star Wars. Go movies. see the new Star Wars on um. Looking looking at Mark. Go see the new Star Wars. On, I uh, have free tickets, but like my girlfriend and I are trying to figure out what day to go. Dude, go today. Wait, I'll like go three with days you guys and totally starts. be the third wheel. I can go no, no, with no, you dude, guys. Dude, 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 I'll, I'll go with you. We, you'll be my date. Dude, let's do it. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> um, Who will I go with? No, but seriously, you, you on, with me. On okay. um, you're also my date. On uh Tuesdays at like uh, I, I think it's I think it's from like nine a.m. To like three uh, matinee. Yeah, matinee. three p.m. matinee on Tuesdays. I, I think tickets are like five dollars and seventy five cents, which uh, is mm, absolutely. Mm. Can I actually mm. tell you a story? What's up? Okay, so this is one of the first times I went like like this is probably my second or third date that I'd ever been on. Yeah. Well, with like uh, this girl that I was dating a while ago, and we went to the movies, right? So was, I think it was like Pompeii. Yeah. So I think it was horrible. Yeah, I hear that wasn't too great. God awful. Um. <laughs> Honestly, it was a waste of money. But my dad was like, hey, I'm going to go with you. And he sits in the back. Like, he sits like two rows behind me. <laughs> and he's just staring at me the entire time. He's like, you going to put your arm around her? Fucking dare you. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds exactly like your dad, too. Like, 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 it sounds exactly like your dad. Like, oh, I'm, my God. What are you doing? <laughs> he's, he's smoking that dank I'm weed. lighting up. Jesus, <laughs> no, please don't. Oh, my God. But, um... That that sounds exactly like something that your dad would do too. Like I remember at one point I was like, like kind of like about to put, like, put my arm around like that, like looked up at my dad like, is this okay? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like um, um, me and Alex, uh, or rather, uh, Alex was taking me to um Yamacon, oh, uh, no. like like a couple weeks ago, and like I was in full cosplay as Sock Sawachowski. Oh no! And I was sitting eighty four times. I was sitting in Alex's room. Yeah, <laughs> I'll, I'll talk about that in a second. I was sitting in Alex's room and like. <laughs> Alex's dad just walked in and was like, hey, and I said, hey, um, I don't usually look like this. And he said, sure you don't. And then he walked <laughs> out and I was like, oh, this is going to be great. Uh, and then like... And Alex's like, dad wrecked you. <laughs> and like, I, I try not to, like, I, I, I don't let myself get like, like, like you know, upset. <laughs> that stuff really easily. So I was like, your dad is like the most beautiful human being ever. <laughs> oh my god, it was so good. Yeah, Brandon and I warned you about him. Yeah, but it was absolutely true. Um, I got a Starbucks gift card for uh, Christmas. Starbucks has the best tea ever. Like, oh my god. And um, Brandon works at Ingles. Yeah. And so like I went so to Ingles like, yeah. and like yeah, I I I actually went like through Ingles. I mean not Ingles through uh, Lena's line. And she was like, oh, hey Jaden. Like we talked back and forth. And um, I was walking. Then out. you got her fired. <laughs> <laughs> I was walking out and uh, Brandon was like Jaden and like and like I made tea so I like jumped and so I came like, like splashing out like onto my hand. And I went ah hey Brandon. <laughs> Cause like their their drinks when they say their drinks are hot. They're hot. Don't spill it on your crotch. They're, oh my god. You know, um... You can't sue anymore. There is a picture 
of, of like what, what that lady's like torso looked like after after she spilled it. Yeah, it wasn't pretty. Yeah, no. wasn't wasn't pretty like, at all. Like when I first heard about it, I thought it was like oh, it was like a mild like little burn. Yeah, or no, something. it was like charred. It was yeah, yeah, like yeah, straight yeah, up yeah, charred. Yeah, yeah. Her, it was, it was bad. Not not putting that in link dump. Not putting that in the link dump. Put the link dump. You can you can find that if you want yeah, to. But um, that's oh gross. My God. Yeah, no, it's so bad. Yeah, like I thought it was just like kind of like you spit like hot water on your hand. Yeah, yeah, and you're like oh that's like how it's just a little bit red. No, like. Whatever. Like, it, 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 like, legit yeah. scalded her. We're talking about um, charcoal, man. Yeah. Um, yeah, basically, that's what it looked like. <laughs> um, she got wrecked. What was I talking about? Yeah, um, Starbucks, as this thing, like, on their gift cards, where they, like, reward levels, or, like, depending on, like, how many drinks you buy from there, it, like, has, like, levels based on what you buy. And, um, I reached a green level, level on up. Starbucks, which is where, um, I can get free uh, refills and Starbucks drinks now. Level up. Oh. And I'm like, and like, it's this whole thing with me where I'm like, I don't need to do this, but like, I feel compelled to get like, like as many levels as I can. And, um, I, I think if you reach a uh, gold level, which is if you get, um, 25 stars a- a- in like the course of like a calendar year, y- um, a- every like 10th drink you get free. Oh, shit. And, um, and I'm like, I have to reach that. And so what I found... Is like my my uh, grandmother um, buys like I don't know how to word this like um, pre ground coffee like the kind you put yeah, in like a coffee yeah. maker like, she, she she buys uh, the Starbucks brand coffee and it has stars on it and you can put those on your card and I figure like like if she drinks like like a package of those a week it's like fifty two weeks in a year I'm gonna reach gold level mm. and and like <laughs> and like it doesn't really matter like because I I could honestly like it honestly really doesn't matter to me. But it's just like ten, like ten hey, drink hey, Jamie, free. Oh my god, what's can I up? Show you something real quick. You don't take a picture of me. No, I'm not <laughs> taking a picture. Of me. Sure. You just lean okay. in real quick and listen, listen. Yeah, right. here we go. I'm good. Right. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. Oh god, no! I messed this <laughs> up. <laughs> <laughs> That's the real. I have what I wanted to show you. It's this one. It's this one. Here we go. <laughs> I was at his house and I'm like, hold on. I grabbed my phone and recorded that and I sent it to you. I don't know if you got it. It I was like two know. in the morning and I sent that to no, you. No, I didn't get it. I, I need that. Please send that to me. Oh my god. Oh, I messed that up so because like I I couldn't remember if it was the one above it that was uh, Lord Palpatine or if it was it was the one the bold that. Yeah. <laughs> I um. <laughs> Um, like, after I watched, uh, like, like, or rather, whenever I heard that, um, episode 7 of Star Wars was coming out, I was like, you know, I'm gonna watch all the other ones, and so I started doing that, and, like, I, I heard uh, Palpatine say, do, do it. it, and I was like, he, he says it exactly like that, but, do but it. his voice doesn't sound like that, he's like, oh, Luke, you've gotta do it, and I'm like, where did that come from? <laughs> <laughs> like, like, why did he say it like that? Like, it makes no sense. They knew that would be a meme. He's like, Anakin, you must do it. <laughs> and then, God, just, he's, he's the it's worst. It's kind of like one of those moments where there's, yeah. like, there's people invading a base and then it looks like, looks like we're going to have to use the missiles. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm, I'm not sure if you guys know about this, but it's like, oh, piece of trivia. Um, Again? Mace Windu, right? Like, you yeah, know, Samuel yeah. Jackson. Yeah, absolutely. His star- his lightsaber at the. <laughs> <laughs> and you were harping. Why on- would you do that? <laughs> okay, but Mace Windu, like the bottom of his lightsaber, I think it says like "badass motherfucker." How did his hands cover it up? There was a like, like something the similar to that. Says that. There was a like um a like a really popular baseball card that like it was a person like holding the bat like this and the and like the, the base of the bat said like fuck you <laughs> and like it was just like massively like like marketed and popularized like card like someone one day would realize like see this is fuck you <laughs> and then like and, like they just pulled them off from the shelves oh my god like um ever since i got a uh, happy home designer i've been obsessed oh, with um yeah. how many how many cards did you get i i haven't bought any yet like, okay, so like because um, you get a card with the game yeah yeah what did you get yeah um i got uh, a cap and i got tortimer really- Nice! I, I'm really excited. Tate, like, got, it makes Tate got DJ KK. Kate, I mean, not Kate. Tate is so lucky. A single Isabel card is thirty dollars. You you can get a pack of sixteen for five dollars. What what's go like Tate, what? Tate, uh, Tate got a DJ KK. Not yeah, Isabel. yeah, I know. But Isabel is still thirty dollars. And um, th- this dude. You well, crushing on Isabel? This dude. Oh, absolutely. Th- th- there's no secret there. I love Isabel so much. Oh. But um, you can buy the entire um, 
like like I guess series one card like series in Japanese for ten thousand dollars. A dude is legit selling it on eBay for ten thousand dollars. Huh, not worth it. What would you what would you do with ten thousand dollars, Alex? Buy that. <laughs> What would you do with ten thousand dollars? Definitely not that. No, uh, but I mean, like, I, I mean, like, seriously, wh- wh- what do you think you would do with ten thousand dollars? With ten thousand yeah. dollars, I would honestly, the first thing I'd probably do is I'd just buy every game I've ever wanted. <laughs> like, it's like, oh man, when I was like three, I wanted this app. So, I would, I would buy a really nice computer, and I'd give like a hundred dollars to all my friends, like, like because like in the past, like I've never been able to, like buy gifts from my uh, from my friends or anything so i'd be like 100 bucks 100 bucks 100 bucks to so anybody how, that how I much could. how much would you say that uh that computer would cost you like out of that ten thousand three thousand dollars if if i had ten thousand dollars i would go all out so, on a computer yeah. like like i would make like too. like a scientific what are you gonna do like, with the other like, like, there like a thousand what are you gonna do with like the other you get a supercomputer like, wait, wait hold on a second what are you saying what are you gonna do with like the other six thousand yeah, nine hundred dollars <laughs> Yeah, dude, you're only gonna spend like doing the thing with your friend. You're only gonna spend like three hundred dollars. That's why I said. That's <laughs> right. And the, I was three? like, wait a second, he's dragging me. Yeah, I was like, yeah. Wait a second, he's I really me. was. But um, but um, I think I'll give a lot uh to my mom too, like because, like I said, I mean, my mom never really had a lot, so I'd be like, mom, please go do something awesome for yourself. And then um, I'd probably just invest the rest. Why? Thank you, Jaden. I'm the blessed the with the day that you jumped out of my little. Genus, I'll what? call it that. <laughs> I'm your mom, Jade. Oh, I knew it. <laughs> I'm sorry. Like, I um, knew it. One of my, <laughs> oh no. One of my like um uh, uh, biggest like uh, kind of joke dreams in life is to one day like like have enough money to where I can wear a different pair of socks every day. Like, <laughs> like throw them away. Like I, I just no like, like donate them or something. Or like, give them to Mark or something. Mr. Moreland. <laughs> Mr. Oh. Moreland. Yeah. There is um, there is a, a a thing online where you can buy 365 pairs of underwear, and like. How much is it? Please don't like labeled with dates. Uh, it's like February. 4th. I think you can. I think you can customize them. I think you can do that. But um, oh. there is a um, except it's hard because of the leap years and stuff. Okay, you just have an extra <laughs> one that says February the 31st, the 30th. Oh. oh. But, um... This guy. Don't you mean February the 29th? Yeah, yeah, I was yeah, about yeah, to say. <laughs> Get a load of this guy! I'm gonna pinch your nipples <laughs> so hard they fall off. Someone did that to me in, uh... Sixth grade, now I have, like, permanent bruises there. Actually, I'm, uh, I'm wanna... missing half of my right nipple so, because my brother... We were just talking about that. Um, like, l- like, a dude who really didn't like me did that to me in sixth grade, and, uh, like, a giant bruise grew there. And, the, like, and then, then a giant bruise grew in my other one. And, like, and, like they shrunk, but they're still there. Actually... Um, speak- I, my brother sorry, ripped off half of my right nipple. <laughs> speaking of, I'm not kidding. Speaking of nipples, I have a friend who I will not name. I know this friend. Do you know who it is? Do you, I know who wait, it is. Wait, continue. Wait. Yeah. Yeah. yeah absolutely continue. Absolutely continue. But he has like, like, okay, so they are biologically male. Like he, he, he's biologically male, and he, he has nipples, and they're just fucking like puffy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they're just really puffy, and they like stick out. Like Jeez. they're horrible. We're horrible. What, what happens when he gets knows. cold? It, it, my, my friend probably knows that I'm talking about them. If they watch this. Just. And they're going to know I'm dragging them. <laughs> just like hearing hearing a body part described as puffy just makes me like a little yeah. bit uncomfortable. Yeah, it's like, they're like puffy, like, they stick out a little bit. And they're, oh, they're like, okay. Ugh, they're gross. It, it just makes me like, kind of uncomfortable being like, Mark, you're, like, you're looking pretty puffy today. <laughs> <laughs> I actually feel really stuffy today. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez. Yeah, that was the point of the joke, Alex. <laughs> it's like you ruined. <laughs> <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> Dude, immortal talk. <laughs> immortal Mark. Your Mark is easy to kill. <laughs> Mark, put him in a box while he sleeps <laughs> for five, five Mark weeks. <laughs> you will hear a dog voice coming from the box. <laughs> Ignore what it says. Immortal Mark. <laughs> His breathing is loud. <laughs> oh, God. His body is heavy. <laughs> he stares at the sun. Mark, Mark, I, I, Mark, I have a very serious question to ask you. He loses his vision. <laughs> unblinking. Mark, I have a very serious question to ask you. Um, Why are you blind? Do you, do you see what the sun unblinking? I, I don't know what's up with my vision. It might be because of that. He, he I never did that, but whatever. Sun. Did you look at the sun? He you can't even like see the sun, child? dude. I was looking at the sun through a magnifying glass, you know. <laughs> Jesus. 
<laughs> what? It was when so was small little, up there. I needed to <laughs> make it so I can. When I was little and um and in Boy Scouts, I'd be like, yeah, you know, like if you take a magnifying glass, you can like harness the sun. I was like everything on fire. Like I would just like <laughs> things on fire constantly. Like um, I want to let myself on fire. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm kidding. Um, have you ever like poured alcohol like in your hand and then up your arm and set it on fire? No, Mark, because that's how people <laughs> die. <laughs> There's actually a uh, that one there's, a, there's like actually that? a uh, vi- I'll talk, yeah absolutely there's a video of, of that online where like um the, these people um it was like a pit crew there was like a, 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 an invisible methanol fire that broke out and like it burned like actual fire but they couldn't see it so so like they were all like writhing on the ground like burning alive <laughs> and like and, like one dude like like, like ran over <laughs> with, like a fire extinguisher <laughs> and he got on fire. No, you, he runs over with the fire no. extinguisher and he pulls the pin and it's invisible fire extinguisher stuff. No, like, like <laughs> so he's just like. <laughs> what, would you, what would you do if you just walked into a room and just saw people like rolling up? It, it was terrible. But, like, 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 like it was kind of funny, but like in all reality, it was terrible. You like look over, like, it's like this fire. extreme charade, the silent like, killer. Um, <laughs> I think it was the kind of funny where, like, where, like this dude took a video of, 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 of like this baby mouse and they're like, at least in the baby mouse back out in the wild today, like we've been oh, yeah. for a long time. And they put him down, he's like, free little buddy, and the bird just goes, <laughs> yeah. And just kept first, it. first of all, Alex, the thing you said about charades, that like if you just walked in on a bunch of people like rothing on fire in the ground, they're just like, ah, you're like, oh, uh, <laughs> two words, what, yeah. um, <laughs> oh, well, um, um, fire, and they're like, yes, help, <laughs> and they're like, okay, um, okay, you're like, okay, uh, a movie, um, uh, three hundred, and they're like, no help, and they're like, oh, the help, that's a pretty good movie, man, and they're like, no, 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 also is the book the help, and they're like, dead at that point, and, they're like, <laughs> and you're you're seeing them start to be charred now, <laughs> you, you, man, you really. He, he, you're a really sore loser. Yeah. <laughs> Jeez. But, um... <laughs> They're melting. Did you see, uh, the newest episode of Ruby? Chapter 6? You guys say all did kinds you? of things that I don't watch. Did you? No. They released a new episode? Go watch episode 6. I'm gonna watch it. Oh, yeah! Oh, no! <laughs> I'm no, watch it's it right episode now. six. I'm gonna watch it now. Oh uh, no! Uh, w- uh, once we're done here. No, I'm gonna watch it. Now. No, once we're done here, <laughs> we can go upstairs and watch it. Episode what? six. <laughs> Stoned. But um, like it's it, the things start going downhill. Like I'm just gonna tell you that wait, things wait, go from like was this. It, was it the thing with the Yang at the end? Yes. Watch what, the. Was she, like, watch the yeah, anime. Okay, Golden. yeah, yeah. I saw that. Did you see that? He yeah, punched it. Punches what? Mercury. Well, okay, okay. Watch the what? anime Golden Time. Forgive us. Forgive us. What happened? I'm I so worried know. about Yang right now, dude. Is he gonna get arrested? Like I'm so scared for yeah, Yang. And did, did you see like the? Did you see like the coming up next? Are, these guys yeah. are. Yeah, and then I was like, oh god. And then like, a bunch of and then with the with the with Pira fucking and like weebs. there's and there's the <laughs> 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 um, the, the maid of fall. Like made I fall. feel so they bad can't, for her. They can't, like, like she was they just can't so hear us right now. And like Pierre is so pure, so nice. And Yang is right so pure, so nice. And she was like, <laughs> they're weaving out. It's okay. Jumps at her. It's okay. And she defends herself. But but like but I mean I I think I found out that that like I haven't eaten much today and I feel kind of bad. But they're I think they're just gonna talk about the weave stuff for a little bit. Like I'm pretty sure that his aura, his semblance is a little. So Dan, like I'm pretty sure that's why he was able to kind of like do that. Huh? Dan, how are, how are you doing, Dan? I don't think it's Cinder's, like, because, because oh, we what? didn't know hers. Oh. Yeah, yeah. yeah. She, she's Cinder? in dust. Don't, don't you mean... Oh, no, okay, Cinder. See, I was thinking of, uh, uh... Emerald? Flint Cole. Flint, and I was no. like, yeah, because, like, they're both related to fire. But, yeah, no, like, like I mean, it could be Cinder. I, I just want to kick Cinder in the chin. Like, yeah. like I just really want to kick Cinder hardcore in the chin. Like, <sighs> like, I just... Oh, my God. Um... Probably should have warned about uh, spoilers because we just like completely went all out about Ruby episode six. Yeah, but I mean, um, it's been up for a couple weeks though, so it's fine. Yeah, it's it just has been up for like, a couple weeks. But like, I just, I'm just so worried about Yang, like because <laughs> she didn't. Well, let's get close to the mic. We gotta, we gotta battle for our territory. But like, like, because Yang never did anything wrong, all she wants to do is protect Ruby and the team, right? Yeah. And like, of course, if somebody was like <laughs> springing at you and, and was like, oh, just defend yourself. Yeah. It's like, like she was walking around and she punched him yeah. in the thigh. And like, and then like, I, I went, or, or like, rather, like I paused like at the scene where it was like Blake and Weiss and Ruby were able to like, to, like they all looked shocked. And I was like, Yang, no, I will fight all of you guys. Like, yeah, yeah. like, 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 like whenever you showed like Emerald and Mercury, and Mercury was like, was, <laughs> please. And Mercury was like, why would she do that to me? I was like, I will. I will shove my sock down your throat. 
Hey, Mark, do you want to see that for a second? Do you want to see that for a second? Let's see that for a second. We're going to have to wrap up. But um, uh, thank you guys for listening. It means a lot. Um, it means a whole bunch. Um, as always, thank you guys for listening. There's going to be another episode next week. Uh, we're, we might have, we might have Mark on. Um, we might not, we, Mark might, be, may, might not be around next week. We... <laughs> We are, uh, oh, yeah, yeah, oh I think somehow you guys paused the video. <laughs> oh, no! I know! <laughs> anyway, Up we, anyway, you. anyway, as I was saying, we, we are probably gonna have, uh, Zach on next week. Um, I, I'm still wrapping up, uh, San Angel the Third, like I said. Um, thank you guys for listening. Is there anything you guys like to say as we wrap up? Would you guys like to plug anything? Uh, you know, do anything? I think we're good. I... Just have a good, have a good day, guys. Thank you guys very much. Mark's not. Happy See ya. New Year's. I hope you're 2016. Bye, guys. Love you. Ah.